as you can see, um, I have, oops, that one is in quotes, I don't know why. Okay, so as you can see, I have all the text um, boxes um, with the set at each different index of the array. And like we talked about, all the names are in um, evens, and all the scores are odds. So, and remember, the SQL query pulled all this information in, in order, from highest score to lowest score of the top 10 scores. So this is basically just displaying that information as the way it was imported. Okay. And let's see. We want to add one more quick event. That is another Ajax and on completed to post score. Remember we added that tag to the uh, post score Ajax event earlier. And in here, when that's completed, we want to set the value of each x to 0. And we want it to automatically pull in new scores. So that way, um, after it's done and completed, it'll refresh the, the list. So after you submit a score, it'll refresh that list in case, you know, your name is on the score. So we're going to do an Ajax and request URL. And we're going to do that same one as before. We're going to tag it, get score again. That way the uncompleted of get scores will activate or again. And again, it's this, um, oops, it's the get scores one. Okay. All right, let's move that up. Oops, let's move that up around that one. Okay, so yeah, um, I believe that is all completed. Now, I've never had luck getting this to work um, testing right out of construct. Um, I always have to export it and put it on the website to try it. I know there's something you can do with the header. I'm not sure how that works. It's always pretty convenient for me to just upload everything. So, um, so yeah, I think this is all complete. I'm just going to run through it real quick um, and make sure we got everything. So our score will be 12,000. Uh, we'll put that. We'll click that. It'll enter into the database. It'll return. It'll refresh it. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and compile this and put it on my website, and we will test it out.